So the greatest rappers of all time, according to Family Feud, on a recent episode of Family Feud, there was a round that asked the contestants for the greatest rapper of all time. Let's listen to how it went. Who is the greatest rapper of all time? J. Cole. <laughs> Andre. Kendrick Lamar. Hey. Ryan. Yes. Lil Wayne. Hey. Okay, okay, y'all tripping now. Okay, Kayla. It's Tupac. Let's go with Biggie. Jay-Z, number one. Jay-Z. Oh, oh, damn. Whoa. Are y'all tripping? Nas. Hey. See, I think you're thinking as a hip-hop head. Mm-hmm. I don't think that's who answered these questions. <laughs> Who's the greatest rapper of all time? Eminem. Yes! Kayla, who's the greatest rapper of all time? Snoop Dogg. Yes! Drake. <laughs> Snoop, they actually had that number one. That's, that's, why, uh, that's why those polls and surveys are subjective, because it's all about who you're talking to. But not Snoop for number one, yo. I don't care. That's crazy. Anyway. And they probably, whoever right. they was talking to probably didn't even look at greatest the way we look at greatest. They're like the most popular. Right. Yep. Yeah, that, they, that was right. the most popular list. Yeah, because do they? I wonder if they still do it like they used to. They you, they used to show, like, people, like, man on the street. Like, they asking a bunch of random people. No, I haven't seen that in a long time when they did it Dang, like that. But I, I know that's how they used to come up with these mm -hmm. answers and put them in order like this. But to clarify, the list, the answer list was number one, Snoop Dogg. Number two, Tupac. Number three was Eminem. Number four, Dr. Dre. Number five, LL Cool J. Number six was Biggie. Number seven was 50 Cent. And number eight was Jay-Z. Hey, say what you want. Them the most famous rappers in the world. That's the most popular. <laughs> you can say yeah. that. Yeah. I don't care where you go in the world. You ask somebody about rap, they probably going to name one of those uh, Absolutely. eight people. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Especially white people. They yep. definitely do this list. But Steve, he issued an apology when the round was over, though. He couldn't even believe it. That's what he said. <laughs> Before we flip over these last three, I want to apologize to the entire hip hop community. <laughs> Jay Z's last. What the world? Number seven. He could not believe that. <laughs> he could not believe it. But and neither could I, honestly. Like mm -mm. you said, these people don't think of hip hop like I mean of all time like we think of them. Mm -mm. Yeah, that's crazy. Cause my father would have said Eric B. Rock Kim. Like he'd have said KRS One. <laughs> Like Big Rapper, Daddy yeah, Kane. Yeah, Big Daddy Kane, all that. He, yeah, they, he'd been, it'd have been different. So, of all time, it's kind of crazy. Mm -hmm. But that is Jess with the mess right there for three minutes. <laughs> Thank you, Jess, for, <laughs> Jess yeah. with the mess. Charlamagne, who are you giving your donkey to? Man, four after the hour, uh, we need a dentist from Tampa Bay, Florida, named Richard Cantwell to come to the front of the congregation. Ask yourself, would you want this man in your mouth? We'll discuss. Okay. All right. Well, we'll get to it next. It's The Breakfast Club. Good morning. Wake that ass up. Early in the morning. The Breakfast Club.